they got a fever down in Nevada, and the only cure is more Ron Paul. Good evening, everybody. Once again, this is Hell's Unicorn here, and there's a little bit of breaking news. Apparently, Clark County GOP officers, uh, five in total, have decided to quit. Now, I have always been one to assume that the establishment were pretty weak, but I didn't think they were quitters. And the truth is, is that they actually have not quit. They're just regrouping and repositioning, or redeploying, as it were. All five of the people that left this Clark County Republican Party, which is now a Paul dominate, Ron Paul-dominated party, so to speak, have decided to jump ship and go to the uh, shadow party that the Romney campaign has been setting up in Nevada. So in other words, Mitt Romney, contrary to what everybody might tell you, is actually going to run third party. In a sense, anyway. So, let me just read this little quote. Uh, this was uh, put on the uh, Republic, uh, Columbus, Indiana, out uh, news outfit, so to speak. Here, I got a link in the description. This is from former Vice Chairman Woody Straup. He told the Associated Press on Thursday, that's today, that Paul supporters have been picking fights with the RNC and are not interested in electing all Republicans. Not interested in electing all Republicans. Now this is the part where I think we need to take a little bit of a lesson. This is where we differ with the so-called establishment. We're not interested in electing all Republicans. No, we are interested in electing good Republicans, real Republicans, non-rhino, warmongering, big government Republicans. That's what we're interested in. And as much as stated by the new acting chairperson of the uh, committee, who is a Ron Paul supporter. The fight for the heart and soul of the Republican Party is by no means over in Clark County. It's simply going to take another form. These former GOP officers are going to be working against us via outside efforts to undermine the Republican Party in Nevada with the hopes of eventually destroying it and then coming back in and building it back up the way it was. My advice to anybody who's got some spare change laying around and can't donate any more to the Ron Paul campaign, send it over to the Clark County GOP and help bolster our newfound majority of the entire party there. If everybody does this and the party brings in more money, all five of these Clark County Republican Party officials will look like complete idiots, which is what they are. So feel free to visit the links and check out the story for yourself. With prudence to myself and benevolence to all of you, good evening.